backup computers on the network, you will install the Retrospect client software on each machine you would like to back up. To view the Retrospect client software installed on an individual machine, you can open up the Retrospect client from the taskbar or from your start menu. Inside the Retrospect client software, you have an option to either turn the client on or off by checking or unchecking this box. If the box gets unchecked so that the client is disabled, it will be re-enabled automatically next time the client restarts. You will see the name of the Retrospect client and the IP address. You'll see the status that it's currently being backed up. You'll see the last backup, the approximate time of the next backup, and the progress of the current backup. You have the ability to either uh, display the Retrospect client down on the taskbar or not display it on the taskbar. Under the History tab, Retrospect will show you a listing of each disk that was backed up from this machine, and it will give you the ability to restore data directly to your own machine by going into this tab. Once you click the Restore button, it will display a listing of all the files and folders backed up on that date, and the individual user can mark and unmark items they would like to restore. Under the Notification tab, you can be notified after a backup, or you can be notified if there's no backup in a certain number of days. You can also be notified if your local disk is reporting a smart disk error. The Privacy tab allows you to exclude specific items from the backup so that they are hidden from the backup server. If you have an executive as an example, the executive may have a specific directory that they do not want seen by the backup administrator and so it can be completely excluded from backups. There's also a schedule tab that allows you to delay any proactive backup operations so that you're not disturbed throughout the day. All of the settings inside the Retrospect client software can actually be modified by opening up the Retrospect application on the backup server and by going to Configure Preferences and then going to Clients, you as a backup administrator can specify which options the user can control within their Retrospect client control panel. You can also specify which backup sets you want to have available for the Backup On Demand feature. 